homes. Baltimore County Police have identified the man they say stabbed five people in Hunt Valley on Saturday. WJZ is live. Paul Gessler is at Town Center there in Hunt Valley with more on the suspect and his history, plus an update on those victims. Paul? Good afternoon, Tim. Yes, the, uh, everything appears back to normal here outside Hunt Valley Town Center after five people were stabbed at multiple locations here Saturday. This is video of Jamal Ramon Taylor before Baltimore County Police fatally shot him on Shawan Road Saturday afternoon. The 31 year old police say was holding a knife used in a stabbing spree moments earlier. He was demanding money from people, he was being aggressive with people, and that he was threatening people with some sort of a box cutter. Next thing you know, someone screamed that there's a, he has a knife, he has a knife. Um, and they kind of got a little crazy from that point. Three people were stabbed inside the Hunt Valley Wine, Liquor and Beer Store with what was later described as a three-inch folding style knife. Two others at neighboring businesses. All five victims have what police describe as non-life-threatening injuries. The 911 call came in around 1.45 p.m. Saturday. Oh, my. Oh, timing is everything. I'm glad we weren't here this afternoon. Oh, my oh. Lord. We just came for beer. I mean, we, we didn't know this. We just pulled up. We didn't realize this all happened. This is amazing. That is horrendous. Taylor had previously been convicted of burglary and assault in two prior incidents in Baltimore City. The officers involved in the shooting have been placed on routine administrative leave. Back live in Hunt Valley now, police are investigating the timeline of Saturday's events, including a potential separate incident with transit police earlier in the day. Reporting live in Hunt Valley, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ.